all right welcome to another video on my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to create a custom email from your domain we're going to learn how to do that in cpanel we are going to create something like a hack that's going to allow you to create your custom email and every email that you get in your cpanel will be redirected to your gmail and that way you'll be able to view every email in your gmail address and then you'll be able to reply directly within your gmail interface subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to turn on the notification so now let's get started so I'm going to log into my cPanel and under email, I'm going to click on email accounts. And if you've never created before, this place will be blank. So all you need to do is go up and on the right, left hand, right hand side, click on create and then select your domain and choose the username. In this case, csupport at nameplustraining.com. Generate a password. You can type it manually or generate it and then you can choose storage space unlimited or whatever you want and every other thing leave it as, as it is and click on create so and now it will be created and you can click on view to view or check email and use one of the email clients or, or round cube so let's just click on any one of them let's click on round cube and then you see the welcome email that's the configuration settings and you can see all the settings uh, that's what you're going to get after creating your name i can see c supports at netplustraining.com so let's click on check email here and of course it's the same thing and we need to link it to our gmail address so you need to click on this settings and click on see all settings and then go to accounts and imports and you can see add another email address just click on that let's add an email address because we want to be able to view our emails of course inside our gmail instead of logging into cpanel all the time to check our email so i'm going to click on the first one so you can see there are three areas but I'm going to click on the top one and then it's going to open a new tab and I'm going to select a name so net loss training or whatever name you want and then of course the email address is going to be c supports at netplustraining.com click on next and then on the username enter the same c support at training.com the SMTP server is going to be the URL of your hosting account. So just go to your, then you can see the business 22.com point. And we're going to add that on that SMTP server. So let's click on that. The ports choose the, leave it at default, TLS, and then choose a password. Just leave the CLL and then click on add account. And of course, you can always choose the, the SSL version also. So now we can we need to verify that we've added uh, that to our email address. So I can close this, check our email because we will be sent an email in that particular email in cPanel. Let's go back and uh, check the email let's go back again check email c support and networks training then run cube and we'll get another email gmail configuration and then there's a link there just click on the link just to confirm then click on confirm and click to go back to your gmail address and now you've been able to add a custom email create a custom email and then you've been able to add it to a gmail if we go back to the account and import you discover now we have the c support at net plus training so anytime you get an email it will be forwarded from your c panel to your gmail and then you'll be able to view it in your gmail 
So one more thing we need to do, we need to forward it to our Gmail address. So we'll go back down and then we see under email, forward us. And now we need to forward the email from our cPanel to our Gmail so, so that we'll be able to view. So now we need to enter. So these are the ones that I have already that have been forwarded to Gmail. So let's click on add forwarder. And now let's click on the email, of course, the C support at, and then we select the domain. C support, select the domain netplustraining.com. And now forward to, I want to forward it to my abilat to so so my gmail.com and then click on add forwarder. So every time I get sent email to that email address, it will be forwarded for my C panel which is my hosting to my so let's just click create an email for example let me use my net plus systems let me just send i just wanted to test if this email will be delivered so i want to test just to confirm that we're going to get that in our gmail address so regards net plus systems and then let's send so click on send let's go back to our gmail address refresh you see net plus system probably going to be efficient because it's the same ip address so let's click on that you can see it's efficient because of course we are checking we're sending and checking the email address but you won't have this problem if somebody else were to be if you send it to somebody else you won't have this uh, problem so now you can see it working and anytime you get sent an email to that custom email address you just created and then you forward it to your gmail address you'll be able to check in your gmail address so that's how to create a custom email and forward it to the gmail address for free